The title is Rather Be the Devil, Rather Be the Devil, which is a song by John Martin, um, one of my favourite musicians. So it's an Inspector Rebus novel, except Rebus is no longer a police inspector. He's retired. He's a consulting detective. He's still getting in people's way, still wanting to be a cop, but really can't be an official cop, so he's more like a private eye. Um, and uh, he's got some health issues, and to take his mind off that, he decides to dust off an old unsolved case that he worked on from about 40 years ago, a socialite, a woman who'd been having an affair and was found dead, strangled in a posh hotel room in Edinburgh. I think it was around about 1984, 85, when I wrote the first book and got the idea for him, and he was already pretty fully formed. You know, right from the start, I said, main character, maybe a cop. And he was a cop not because I was interested in crime fiction, but because I thought a detective was a good person to look at different layers of society. A detective has an access all areas pass to the highest in the land and the lowest in the land. So that if I want to look at Britain, specifically Edinburgh, top to bottom, a cop is a pretty good means of doing that. Rebus has been successfully dramatised on, on radio and of course the audiobooks have been have been great fun and, and the narrators, the actors that do it seem to really enjoy doing it, which is great. And and I'll often get a phone call saying, how do you pronounce this word? Or um, what, what does this mean? What kind of intonation should I be trying? Is it being funny here? Is it being serious? What kind of, what's happening here? And I, I love doing that. Um, and actors often, I mean, they really get into the, the, the character. But I think it's nice if it's if it's a spoken word because because the listener, like the reader, are having to use their imaginations. They're having to paint the pictures. It's not being presented to them on a plate. So every listener to the audiobooks, uh, to the audible versions, will have their own idea what these people look like. <laughs>